What's going on, everybody? It's Brandon with Jarhead Diagnostics. I hope you guys are having a wonderful night. Um, I just want to stop by, say hello, and kind of mention what we got going on. We're going to be at AST next week. If you don't know what AST is, it's one of the East Coast's largest training events for the auto industry for both shop owners and the technicians. Why does that matter to you? If you want to advance your career as a technician, you need to go to AST. With the training that's available there, you'll be able to bring your career from here to up here with just the knowledge and the networking. The networking is one of the best things about AST because you're gonna be around hundreds and hundreds of like-minded people and that's gonna be able to have a shoulder to lean on. So you'll learn something in a class and then you're using that in practical applications and you might forget a step. Well, in your networking, pick up the phone and from the phone numbers you got ASTE, give them a call and be like, hey, I've got this going on. They'll be able to help you out. Also, if you're a shop owner, why is AST good for you? If your shop is struggling or you're trying to get to that next level of shop ownership, you need to be able to go to a training event so that way you can learn how to manage the business. Because being a technician and being a shop owner are two totally different things. So if you go to training, you can learn how to be a shop owner and make your business profitable. Same with um, as a technician being able to network, you can start networking with other like-minded shop owners and they can kind of put you under the wing and you guys can guide each other to the next spot in your career. It's excellent. If you're a shop owner, you can do technical training as well. So if you're a one-man band where you need to run the shop and you're working out back, maybe split up your training, do some shop management classes as well as technical training. There's training that service advisors can go to. It is 100% an auto industry training uh, event. It's excellent to go to. We are gonna go, this is gonna be our third year attending. Our first year was in 2019. I just went as a nobody. It was my first training event ever. And I can hands down tell you that that training event changed my outlook on our industry. It was mind blowing. I would not be standing right here right now if it wasn't for ASTE because before I went to ASTE I was about to just get out of the industry because I was tired of it. I went to ASTE and I realized that there were so many more people that were like me and it just gave me that passion to get back into it. We went back in 2021 um, with Jarhead Diagnostics. We had a booth and it was just an amazing experience. Um, we're looking forward to seeing a lot of people again this year and we just we can't wait. Um, AST last year was a very humbling experience for us. We didn't realize the, um, the support that we had from all of you. We know, you know through our orders, okay, people are buying it, but we didn't really understand how much people enjoy Jarhead Diagnostics until we got there and it was just person after person after person talking to us. And we cannot wait to talk to all of you guys whenever we get there this year. As soon as we walk through the door of the hotel on Thursday, I hope to just, you know, start talking to anybody that I can. Um, I, I love talking to everybody. So we're going to be there. Um, Saturday is a trade show. We are going to be set up with a trade show booth. If you went to AST last year, we had a single booth. Um, this year, we're going to have two booths side by side to give us a lot more room. Um, we're going to have all of our products out, and I'll be standing there answering any questions and just talking to whoever wants to be talked to. We are going to have some new products. Um, these new products right here are only going to be available at ASTE, and then after ASTE, they'll go on the website. So from now until ASTE, this is all you're going to get, see, as just seeing what it is. And then um, ASTE will get the first dibs on the initial product run, and then after that, it'll go on our website and be available to everybody else that could not attend ASTE. Um, first things first, we've had a lot of requests for the Altel 408 oscilloscope that they wanted our scope mount kit. So we made it. Um, it's going to be with the universal adapter and it's going to be the same as our Pico and the e scope setup, uh, but it's going to fit the 408. So if you need to mount the 408 to the back of a laptop or if you just want to put it on your roll cart for storage, this mount will be able to help you. Next up, we've got our Pico holder. So we've already had the Pico holder out for uh, probably about a year and a half now. Um, a lot of people like it, um, but being the military people that we are, we had to make a Claymore one. So front towards enemy, point this thing towards the car, and get some diagnostics done. 
couple this with our grenade VA sensor and you'll be able to take on anything that you need. Um, it's the same setup as the other ones, just mount it on there, but it's badass. Next up, we've had a lot of people with the Altel Ultra ask to make a VCI holder for the Altel Ultra. So this has got the same setup as all the other ones, but it's also going to mount to the Ultra. So the Ultra's got two mounting bolts, kind of down here on the bottom, you can see them. Two mounting bolts, they're going to mount up here. And then I use just a tiny piece of uh, double-sided sticky tape just for a little bit of bottom support. You don't really need it, but it just kind of gives it a little extra support. And you can mount your VCI to the back of it. It's good for storage, or if you are using your scope and you just want the scope attached to the back of the Ultra while you're using it, now you can. Um, or if you just need to store your VCI and you want to mount it to your cart, you can get a universal adapter throw it on your cart, pull the VCI off your Ultra, slap it on your cart, and it's good to go. Um, next one up is one that a lot of people have been talking about is our command circuit tester. Our command circuit tester is a um, relay bypass, relay tester, or relay circuit tester, and then if you just need to power up any components, there is a fuse link in here, so that way you can have fuse power to power up a component. On this side right here, this side is the one that you'll use for the relay control side. So if you're trying to figure out if you've got a relay command working, you can plug, tap in at the relay, put your powers and grounds for the relay control side on here, and then activate that circuit. And if you see this light kick on right here, that's telling you that your relay is working. And you also hear the relay clicking here, but visual, you'll see a visual light of the relay kicking on right here. On this side, if your relay commands aren't working, but you need to start the vehicle. So let's just say, for instance, you're trying to start a vehicle and the starter relay is bad and you're just trying to get into the shop. You can not hook into this side, hook your power and ground up here, and then probe in on the relay control or, or on the relay or all the way down to the starter here, and just hit the button. And it's, with the internal relay on here, you can actually power up the starters, power, power windows. I mean, whatever you need to power up, you can do it on this side with your 12 volts. Then it's also got a meter on the top. It's going to tell your battery voltage. So if you're testing a circuit and let's just say you might have a voltage drop, it's automatically going to show up here without any additional probing in. It's going to come with two 12 inch leads, black and red. These are designed for the relay control side. So these are the ones that you just kind of probe in at your um, relay. Then you've got three three foot leads. You got red, black and green. Go to this side. This is going to be for your powers and grounds. And then the green you can just use as your power out to whatever component you're trying to power up. And two alligator clips. Like I said, all these products are going to be available at ASTE. And we look forward to seeing you guys there. If you see us out and about, come shake our hands. Um, it's going to be myself and my wife Kristen. We just want to meet everybody and talk to anybody that we can. We just, we love everybody. We love the industry and we really hope to see everybody there. And if you're trying to figure out about ASTE, go to www.asteshow.com. Um, there's still tickets available. There's still classes available. You can still get in. If classes get full, you can still get a, um, a pass just to get into the show and just network with people from all the different um, little events that they have going on inside of the show, minus training. So we look forward to seeing everybody there. While you're there, pick up some sweet new products, and we'll see you guys in about a week. Thank you. Always remember, did you die today, bro? Brand with Jarhead Diagnostics. I'll see you later.